What's up guys? I'm back with the J.R. Watkins Vanilla Sandalwood Body Wash for Men. This comes in an 18 ounce container. Uh, the container itself looks almost identical to the uh, bar soap that I reviewed, the bergamot and uh, citrus bar soap, uh, bergamot and oak bar soap. Uh, so this is pretty nice. I uh, did enjoy the scent. Uh, I wish it was a little bit stronger and I wish it lasted a little bit longer in the shower, but it does have a pretty nice scent. You pick up the vanilla, I think, more than you pick up the sandalwood in here. It's a very, very mild sandalwood scent. You're not going to get uh, a huge aroma of it. And to be honest with you, it actually smells like a vanilla Coke. If anybody remembers what uh, vanilla Coke smells like, that's what you're going to get with this. But very mild. Uh, overall, I... Uh, I thought this was an okay body wash. I'm not going to label it uh, with some of my favorite body washes. Right off the bat, I can tell you the hinge in the back sucks. It does leak all over the place. So make sure it's nice and tight at the top or you are going to get some leakage from the back and a little bit around the sides as well. So I wish they did these hinges a little bit better. Um, this is one of the more mild scented soaps so if you're a man and you do not like the heavily fragrant man scents and musky scents you'll probably want to gear yourself uh, towards something like this um this had a good foamy lather in the shower i used it both ways i put it on my hand and directly onto my body and it had a nice creamy foamy lather and then i squirted some onto a loofah and rubbed myself with it washed myself and it had a really rich thick and foamy lather uh, price point, I paid this $4.99 at Shoppers Drug Mart. It was on sale 50% off. I think the actual retail price of the soap is uh, somewhere around the $10 mark, which, to be honest with you, I think is too much. I think if you can pick this up on sale, it's a, it's a good deal for 5 bucks. Anything more than that, I probably wouldn't recommend it. When you get out of the shower and towel off, you're not going to smell anything uh, in relation to the soap on your body. It, like I said, it's a very, very, very mild scent and uh, you're not gonna pick this up at all after the shower. In the actual shower itself, after about a minute or two, you don't even smell it anymore. It's so mild that it just fades away into the mist of the shower. Uh, did leave my skin slightly dried out, um, which is fine for the price point. If you're paying a body wash around four or five bucks, J.R. Watkins is a good line, whatever. Uh, what are you gonna do? You gotta take the good with the bad, right? So that is my review for the J.R. Watkins. Simple review, good body wash. Uh, probably not something that I would keep in my arsenal of uh, of uh, shower uh, washes, but definitely something for the average everyday going to the gym, coming home, showering before and after work. This is your typical everyday man body wash. And to be honest with you, I wouldn't even label this as a man's body wash. This is definitely gender neutral. Uh, if you're a, a female, this is definitely could be either or female or masculine scent. So don't be intimidated by the J.R. Watkins and the sandalwood. Uh, women, you can definitely use this body wash as well and it'll probably smell fantastic on you. Anyways, folks, that is the review. Like always, stay clean and take care.